back to my youtube channel today in this video i will uh, explain you how to monitor end user activity in the sophos firewall and how to track what kind of activity they are doing right so as per the activity you can uh, you can block or uh, unblock the categories and block the application in the sophos firewall so let's see right so I'm just go to the firewall. I'm just logging my firewall. Again, I will show you how to log in. I know you are, you guys are know how to log in. So this is our firewall. Now I am going to log in my firewall. And in the firewall, the one module, one bundle is provided by default. The license, including the same license, is the reporting reports. Okay, so Sophos onboard reporting in the configure in the local box, right? So that is the feature. You can check all the activities, uh, all the application activities, all the BAF content activities, thread activities, network thread activities, application BAF application thread activity, VPN, email, compliance as well as compliance as well as custom report. So Today in the video, I will explain you how to track the end user activity in the Sophos reporting, right? So in this, you first of all, I check which user is logging in the currently in the network. So I'm just go to the current activity and see, you can see the all the user login via STAS or login via Capti portal. You can track here right current activity and live users or also track you can live connections right so as i am logging with amit.sharma in this system which is i am uh, opening my firewall in this system like this one i am logging multiple website here youtube yahoo fortigate so as per the traffic generated by this pc right so uh, first of all we can track two types of traffic in this firewall first you can track the diagnostic and go to the packet tracer this is very important things because some people are working on organization level uh, firewall then you can you receive the in information from the end user this website i am not able to access right this category i am not able to access so first you can uh, for, for this troubleshooting this is very necessary tool in house in house in the uh, firewall so you just go to the packet trace and then trace the ip address here so as my system ip address is 10.10.0.27 so my system is going with the which rule id and like this i'm just refreshing again So like my system uh, traffic going through the rule ID one. So this is the best practice to track the troubleshooting times users traffic is going which rule. Okay. Next thing is we go to the report. As per our topic, how to monitor the end user activity so this is the all uh, traffic dashboard so you can see here like application traffic application categories uh, for now there is no listed categories in the firewall so it's showing unclassified so there's a application port which port they are using 443 53 right others and application users here you can track the application you see this my user is i am logging in this system amit.sharma so my name is captured by the firewall okay so you can track easily track from here with this user which kind of application are using so like i am click on the amit.sharma 
you can check here the source zone is lan destination van unclassified application applications kya applications protocols which protocol we are using so this types of categories are using by the amit dot sharma right so you can monitor all the categories all the uh, uh, country wise traffic you can monitor here have allowed policy you can monitor here so all the detail is comes by the dashboard other thing is you can also track the custom report for tracking the particular user details so you can type report type is customized web surfing report or web virus report so for the user and user activity you just click on web surfing reports and go to the report type is detail because search in the detail report might take some time and can consume system resources yeah so it's take it some time so recently we have login in the system so maybe my report is not generated because it's taking so time but i'll try to to fetch the report so this is our user and you can also track the category url or ip address as per your requirement you can track the activity so i'm just clicking on the detail summary and search in the urls and click on the group you can also mention the group here group name is here so all the which user are coming with the group you can take the group details also but i am not taking the group i am just seeing the particular user traffic so go to the search so like this i have already told you there is taking some time so i am just logging in the system last 5 to 10 minute before so it's not generating the traffic but after some time you can get the traffic on the same customized report so that is the main purpose and this is a very useful for us when we have uh, creating the new policy when we are providing the access rights on the end user as per the requirement they are using multiple other threads they are using multiple uh, torrent websites so you can easily track and you can block it right and other things is also i will provide you here you can also monitoring the log log viewer here you can check the end user traffic what kind of traffic they are using you just go to the firewall or you go to the web content policy web filter the multiple portion as here like i am just clicking the web filter so see this so this is our one of the other, another user f1 fin1 and they are using this website login log, loginlive.com and it's a category of information category technology so you can also track the web url here so you can easily allow or disallow the url for the particular user and also another thing is you can go to the application filter so the all the all the things are comes under the troubleshooting so this here is a very important topic i will explain you so mostly people configure the firewall and how to track the troubleshooting and how to done the troubleshooting so you can use this video and take a, as per uh, your requirement you can do the same configuration on your firewall so like this the fin uh, user are trying to access gaming so it comes under xbox live application you can go to the application window and block the gaming because this is already blocked because i have already set the some policies here so it's showing uh, this kind of application block so i i tell you one more thing the very important information to you the application filter only so blocking category not allowed so you can think about it there is only showing in the blocking category only there is not so allowed so to you can you can easily track the traffic which get which application is blocked and which application is uh, supported to the website so some website are supporting with the application like instagram or something so if you are enable the instagram on web filter but you are not enable instagram application on the application they are end user not able to access the instagram web filter so there are very important things so thank you so much for watching our video i request you to please subscribe my channel and 
लाइक इन कमेंट एंड आई विल प्रोवाइड यू द बेस्ट टू बेस्ट इन्फॉर्मेशन एज पर माई एक्सपीरियंस एंड थैंक यू सो मच फॉर वॉचिंग माई वीडियो अगेन एंड जय श्री श्याम